A stable aeroplane is easier for the pilot to control. An unstable aeroplane moves further away from its intended attitude when disturbed by turbulence. In this video, you will learn about the different types of stability. We'll use longitudinal stability as an example. It relates to the pitching plane, but these terms apply to other axes as well. When disturbed by a gust of wind, positive static stability is the initial tendency of the aeroplane to return to its original attitude. Most training aeroplanes are designed this way. Neutral static stability is the initial tendency of the aeroplane to continue in its new attitude. Negative static stability is the initial tendency of the aeroplane to move further and further away from its original attitude. This is not desirable, so most aeroplanes are not designed this way. Whereas static stability describes the initial tendency of the aeroplane to return to its original attitude, dynamic stability describes the time and how many oscillations it takes to get there. When disturbed by a gust of wind, positive dynamic stability is the tendency of the aeroplane to return to its original attitude after a number of decreasing oscillations. The aeroplane's nose pitches beyond its original attitude in each oscillation, but decreases in amplitude until it settles. Neutral dynamic stability is the tendency of the aeroplane to continue to oscillate without settling down. Negative dynamic stability is the tendency of the aeroplane to continue to oscillate with an increasing amplitude. This is not desirable, so aeroplanes are not designed this way. Most aeroplanes are designed with stability in mind. Some aeroplanes are made to be unstable. We'll discuss how, why and the features that make it so in another video.